Good morning, Cross Point. Hope you're having a great week. Hope you've had time uh, this week to reflect on Sunday's message as uh, we dove into Psalm 73 and uh, we we were listening, uh, we were being taught about praying our doubts. And so I hope you've had time to reflect on that. And also, I want to just tell you how excited we are about this Sunday service as well. This Sunday, we're actually going to be in Psalm chapter 3, and we're going to be talking about our fears, praying our fears. And so as we look at Psalm chapter 3, it's a it's actually a short chapter, but it is packed with a lot of good, good, uh, good verses and just a lot of good takeaways. So I want to read actually one verse to you from that. It's it's in verse three. It says, But you, O Lord, are a shield about me. And so I got to thinking about a shield and what a shield is. And so a shield is used as protection uh, against blows and missiles. And I was as I was thinking about a shield. I was thinking about the armor of God that's mentioned in Ephesians chapter 6. And I want you to think about this. This is this is the armor, the whole armor of God. And actually back up in verse 10 of Ephesians 6, it talks about um, it talks about putting on the whole armor of God. In verse 16, this is what this is what Paul says. In all circumstances, in all circumstances, take up the shield of faith which you can extinguish all the flaming darts of the evil one. So one thing that I want you to understand here is this is this shield is used as we are going into danger, as we are moving forward. Uh, it's not being, it's not relevant if we're running, but as we are moving forward. And you see back in verse one, uh, David cries out to the Lord. He says, Oh Lord, back in Psalm, how many are my foes? Many are rising against me. Talk about the flaming darts that are just coming at David and the fear that is that that is entrapping him uh, during this time. But then we get back to Psalm 3.3 and we have this awesome word and this conjunction here and it says, but, and not only does it say, but it says, but you, but you, O oh Lord, are a shield about me. Hey, this is just a piece of what Justin's going to be talking about uh, this Sunday. And so we hope that you're here with us and we hope that you can join us either uh, in person or, or online. Also, if you're following our daily reading plan, uh, you'll actually start unpacking and reading Psalm chapter 3 tomorrow. You'll be, you'll be reading Psalm chapter 3 tomorrow and on Saturday. And then on Sunday, we will be, uh, we'll be taught and be listening to the sermon. And then on Monday, we will read the whole chapter of Psalm chapter three, just to kind of get, get an overview again and just to be able to reflect on the service. So we look forward to seeing you this week and we hope you have a great weekend.